हेलो स्टूडेंट दिस इज सार ट्यूटोरियल हम प्लीज सब्सक्राइब सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल वी विल डिस्कस टुडे अबाउट वार्क पावर एनर्जी इज ए पार्ट ऑफ फिजिक्स बट इट्स मैथमेटिकल एप्लीकेशन इज ए वेरी वाइड एंड इट इज वाइडली यूज इन डिनामिक्स विच इज ए पार्ट ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स दैट्स वाई वी नीड टू वेरी क्लियर नॉलेज ऑफ वार्क पावर एनर्जी सो Uh, to understand work power energy will uh, so, uh, i i first uh, um, provides uh, uh, their definition uh, their structures uh, what is what it means and as well as their mathematical expressions also um, which are very important to solve any uh, mathematical problem related with it so uh, so Uh, go through this course and of course please subscribe this channel um, i always watch very important important uh, um, uh, uh, chapters uh, of uh, uh, of your math and physics related uh, especially math related uh, topics so please i uh, please subscribe this and i now continue um, first we will discuss work what is the definition of work Uh, the definition is said that uh, definition states that a displacement made by any um, applied force applied force means any force you may, you may apply on any uh, any thing uh, if it uh, displaces through a distance then which we need to do the work this is the definition of work uh, means uh, through a applying force uh, we need to displaces a thing and then we say that we have done the work so work is how can it be mathematically mathematically represented first look this picture here it is a box uh, the box mass is not necessary to calculate the work so box uh, i just applied a force here and the box displaces through a distance d and it reaches to the another place the here so the distance of replacement is d and the applied force is f the work is calculated by multiplying f and d so uh, we calculate uh, through this simple relation but in vector notation it is very uh, it is tough to uh, calculate Uh, first, we have to know that f is a vector, vector product, and um, vector f is a vector quantity, and d is also a vector quantity. But their multiplication is vector multiplication uh, always uh, are two or two type, uh, one square type and one vector type. Uh, vector multiplication if cross vector um, vector vector cross. Vector cos always uh, takes a di direction, and scalar product uh, of two vectors always takes the magnitude also. So work has just magnitude, not its uh, work has no direction. So work is uh, is a product of two vectors, but it is a scalar product um, of two vectors. So here I have uh, given um, the mathematical mathematically work. can be written f cross f into f dot d in vector notation work can be represented by uh, vector f uh, dot vector d it is a scalar product and work has just magnitude but no direction so work is scalar now if if we have any um, um, angle between the applied force and the uh, direction uh, the distance then what will be the uh, calculated work so now look this figure here the dist um, distance uh, and the applied force have a angle theta so how can we calculate the here the work is is scalar product i have sort uh, shortly written uh, i am not going to discuss more about scalar product and vector product i will watch another video to uh, to discuss it what is scalar product what is vector product now in short i have just written two vectors scalar product is mod modulus of a uh, first vector modulus of second vector and the cosine of the angle um, the cosine angle theta of between the vectors so 
here the vector f can be can be uh, uh, divided in two components uh, one um, vertically and one horizontally so vertical components is a mod of f sin theta vectors one component and the um, uh, horizontal component is a mod of f sin a mod of f cos theta so when we uh, we uh, uh, this is, uh, is especially you will have to note that when we will go scalar product we have to take the same direction but when we will go to the vector uh, cross mu cross multiplication then we will take the vertical and the um, horizontal uh, components so we are not going cross multiplication but we are going scalar multiplication this is so we will take this component and the d direction so here work will be the uh, modulus modul, modulus of a vector cos theta and the direction d is modulus value so here we it can be written in this form and that's why you get the scalar form of the um, two vectors here we will get the um, uh, uh, works uh, mathematical expression in terms of vector so you will have to um, study this very carefully uh, here Mm, uh, it is used that what is scalar product and vector product. You, you can go through a, any book, but I will also lodge a um, video on this topic. Thanks, thanks for watching, and please subscribe this channel.